Magic is in the air in Las Vegas. It's time for Men's Apparel Guild in California. Their twice a year show. This is the February show looking at fashions for the fall and winter season. There's a lot to see at Magic. We're going to see just one portion of the show all devoted to shoes. We're in the South Hall of the Las Vegas Convention Center and the sign says FN Platform. That's famous names. It's a famous names platform for shoes, luxury to lifestyle, branded footwear for men, women, juniors, and children. And the South Hall is one large hall. But I can sit down at 6 o'clock. The room is talking all about footwear and even the stairs are carpeted. Something those of us who walk around really appreciate. So we already see some names that we know. I hope they allow us to take a lot of pictures. This is the Splendid exhibit. Splendid is a fashion line and this is the footwear licensee portion. And what I'm told is that the folks who design the footwear look at the fashions and try to incorporate it all together. This particular shoe, which is quite show-stopping, would be around $190 retail. This shoe is Charles by Charles David, and I can't help but think of one of our little singers in Las Vegas, Pia Zadora. She's quite short and wears big shoes. This may be a little too clunky for her, but anyway, it makes a short person tall. I'm sure these ladies are models walking the show floor and showing off everything. More Pia Zadora shoes. This is Pazzo Pure Soul and also Penny Loves Kenny. And they seem to have quite a few interested buyers. One brand isn't enough for Steve Madden. He has Stephen, Freebird by Stephen, Madden Girl, Steve Madden Kids, Superga, Superga, <laughs> and Betsy Johnson and Blondo. Quite a, a lineup. This is the gathering at Freebird. Lots of folks love this part of the brand. Yeah. Looks like kind of outdoorsy stuff. Shoes in the shelves, shoes on the floor. Why don't you guys take a little seat now if you want to. And while you can, fight your way in, drop more. the stuff. And there wasn't as much of a crowd in the Betsy Johnson part of the Madden exhibit. And Madden bought Betsy Johnson a couple years ago. This is part of their bridal collection. And it looks like kind of a Las Vegas wedding here. Lots of bling. And even what you wear to the motel afterwards. And over here is more of the classic Betsy Johnson, but what I loved was the gal here and her not to be ignored necklace. The Blondo brand, which is under the Steve Madden umbrella, is waterproof shoes and boots. I wouldn't call regular blondes waterproof, but Blondo is. This is Lucchese, a brand that had its roots in Italy, but uh, the Lucchese brothers, I'm told, came to the U.S. in the 1800s and started making boots in Texas. Now, the reason I stopped here was to see this beautiful kind of shoe boot with actual, I don't know if you can see it, American alligator as part of the leather. This is a very high-end boot. There, that's better, thank you. That would sell for somewhere between eight and nine hundred dollars retail but it is like none other and it's brand new it's called the Liam L I A M right sure. the Liam by Lucchese correct Chinese laundry is an interesting name for a shoe company and it's an old shoe company been in business 40 years but look at this cute little plant 
I love shoes. J. Renee is another brand that's almost 40 years old and is run these days by the two sons of the original founder of the company. J. Renee is a lifestyle brand and you will find their brands at Dillard's, Nordstrom's, among others, and online at Zappos, of course. Well, can we just imagine what lust for life footwear means? It means footwear that uh, will get noticed, I think. <laughs> you look good. I remember you. Ooh, look at these. Corinne from Cameron B. Shoes. And I noticed her because she was holding a kind of wild pair of shoes. She was wearing a kind of wild, a pair, kind of wild <laughs> pair. And she has a shoe store. Where in Chicago? I'm in Chicago on the south side. I'm on 83rd and Ashland. Cameron B. Shoes. Okay, so based on what you're holding, do you only, uh, is this just a young person's shop? No, so we try to carry fun, fashionable shoes for all ages and all walks of life. Um, I was just t uh, saying that I stopped, before I stopped here, I stopped at J. Renee to get really fashionable um, embellished shoes on a lower kitten heel with a sling back. So I have customers that probably range from 16 to my oldest customer, Miss Eloise Cozy. She was 91, and Yay. she was still wearing high heel shoes. Well, good for Eloise. <laughs> <laughs> that's, that's rare, I can yes. tell you. So what do you do at this show? Um, we buy. So I, I do men and women's shoes, and I do uh, clothing as well. So mm -hmm. this is like the biggest show for all your fashion-forward trends. And this brand, Lust for Life, that we're at, they have one of the newest shoe lines. They've been around a couple of years. A very innovative, new, creative design. It's an awesome okay. line. Thank you very much. Bear Paw is here and they have lots of tables to do business, seem to be doing business. This is the kind of thing that they make. Comfortable and sturdy boots and shoes. London Fog is a brand we know. I'm not as familiar with their shoe products, but the sign here says, London Fog established in 1923. Get a celebrity to wear your shoes and sales will soar. This is Skechers. Skechers has a huge booth here and lots of models, but they aren't necessarily alive. They are here. They are in sporting positions and they are headless but look how large this exhibit is so Skechers is a brand that has really taken off taken the world by storm and I'm not sure why all the candy is here I guess folks could uh, imbibe <laughs> she was offering she was offering me a cookie <laughs> but now she didn't anymore big smile you don't care one whit about the shoes do you look at you happy happy oh smiling that's great well here are a pair of shoes at m4 de pair of shoes a pair of boots that go all the way up to the well, they go all the way up. 